Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to talk about how I stay organized. I have a big hobby or I have gotten this big hobby when uh, 2018 started about bullet journaling. I have my private bullet journal and then I have a panning bullet journal and it is the project panning bullet journal that I'm going to talk to you guys about today. I'm going to flip through how I have set it up and I'm doing a lot of projects at the same time and I need my bullet journal or a notebook in general to keep me organized and knowing what products is in what project and so on. So when you open my bullet journal on the first page, you will have this, your only limit is you. And I chose that quote on top of this uh, print I found on Google that I just printed out and put in it. Um, because the only limit to project planning is really yourself because if you don't put yourself out there, if you don't do anything about your makeup collection and if you want to shrink it, you know, decrease it, then it's up to you, you know? So the only limit is you. So that is the quote I chose for that one. So the next page is my The Book of Panning and I thought that was kind of cool to just put it in there. I'm kind of a nerd and I have doodled some stars and used my pineapple washi tape. I just thought that was kind of cute. And then we have my motivation mood board. I have uh, some quotes and stuff like that. And I really love this mood board because I, if I'm a little bit unmotivated and stuff like that, I'm going to look at this mood board and be motivated again because don't stop until you're proud. Try, try, try again. Be a good person, but don't waste time to prove it. So that can relate a bit to my 2018 plans and goals I have for project planning. Then we have my index. I don't think I'm up to date with that one <laughs> at the moment. Um, and then I have uh, some blank pages for more index because I can definitely not fill out this entire journal in a year. And then I have my 2018 makeup use up and this is my list without the lip products and that is in a lip service project pen that I will show you later. So then we have the projects I am doing and have done and stuff like that. So I have my panda palette. I have written down when I hit pen on them and then when I have finished them. So I can be organized in that way and maybe talk to you guys about when I hit pen and stuff. My project college is just a list when I fill out the square when I have finished one and I have printed out these pictures to motivate myself and be like creative with my spreads so they are not boring to me. And then I have my lip service 18 in 18, I have my measurements and I have my list and again some pictures. Then I have some um, projects, my full face project pen, my finish 8 by Women's Day, it's the same. I have my list with squares and then I take off when I have finished the product and some pictures to keep me motivated. And then I always write down in the corner where it begins, when it begins a project and when it ends. And then I have my nail palette collection, my nail care collection. I had that in another notebook and then it was full and then I just transferred it over in this one. I have my friend's project pan collab and then I have some use up an anti-haul I wrote down but I haven't filmed yet and I don't think I'm going to. May use up, June use up, my video ideas and then it is blank. So you can kind of see uh, I have an ongoing theme of how I decorate my bullet journal. I have a headline, some doodling, some lists uh, with categories and stuff like that and progress pictures. So I have everything in one place and that is very very useful for me. You don't have to do it bullet journal style. You can do whatever you want to but I just really really enjoy doing it like this. I hope that gave some insights of how I'm keeping myself organized. I know it was kind of a random video but I really wanted to show you guys my project planning notebook bullet journal and this way you will never forget what product is in what project which has helped me a lot so i hope you guys like this kind of video if you want some other bullet journal videos please let me know and yeah i hope you guys enjoyed and i hope to see you guys next time